After a serious injury, Simon Tischer completes his comeback and returns to his best by taking apart the star-studded team from Moscow and leaving a few of them dizzy in the process with his distribution. His perfect passes would help his attacking teammates shine brightly throughout the game, and he even found the time to add his name to the score sheet in spectacular style. Opposite, Marcus Nilsson was happy to show off his class again in his team's final league round game away to Paris Volley, where his display would fire Champions League rookie Zirat Bankaza Ankara to the top of Pool B with a 3-1 victory. The poster boy of Swedish volleyball is not only a serious threat in attack, but causes the French team all sorts of problems with his serve as well as with his block. Whether it's at the net or when arriving from deep, PGE Skra Belchatov's Facundo Conte is without doubt one of the most explosive outside spikers in the CEB Dennis Bank Volleyball Champions League. His supernatural jumping ability and unmatched technical resourcefulness are always a delight to watch for his many admirers and fans, and were also the driving force behind his team's commanding win against Czech champions Dukla Liberec. Nemanja Petric is the standout performer in DHL Modena's final group game against ACH Volley Ljubljana, finishing the game as top scorer and securing his team's 3-0 win. The man from Serbia didn't only score his total of 18 points in attack, but was just as deadly from the service line as well as with the block, all of which played a big part in securing top spot in the group and a place in the playoffs. Five winning blocks and an 86% success rate in attack are the impressive stats posted by middle blocker Russell Holmes for a Sekoris Sovia Sheshov against the Dragons Lugano. The man from the United States of America can be proud of a real dream team display, not to mention his side's sixth win in six league round games. Next up, it's the man with the hallmark headband, Felix Fischer. After he and his team threw away the first set, his phenomenal attacks and powerful blocks would guide the Berlin recycling volleys back from the dead in set two. In the end, his inspirational play helped the German side end up 3-2 winners against Arkus Izmir. Knack Rosalares libero Stein de Jonquere stood his ground and was solid as a rock against the star-studded ensemble of Cochina Lube Civitanova. His impressive receptions enabled the team from Belgium to utilize their wide range of attacking combinations. His defensive abilities on the court make him a hard nut to crack for any attacking opponent, and he always seems capable of retrieving the ball and keeping it in play. His positive attitude would motivate his teammates and secure a 3-1 win against the Italian powerhouse, making him the final missing piece in our dream team this week.